back to Vasavi virtual program. This is Satish Kumar, Faculty of Chemistry. My dear children, today we are going to discuss about one important topic from matter lesson and the topic is expansion of matter. So if you observe the slide, my dear students, expansion and uh, contraction of the matter we are going to discuss in this class. So already you have learnt matter is anything that which occupies space and uh, having a mass is called matter. So you have especially uh, depend on the physical properties the matter is classified into uh, three types one is solid and uh, second one is liquids and uh, third one is gases. So my dear children on these three types of matters we can show expansion and as well as contraction. So first of all I am going to take what is the meaning of expansion. So expansion is nothing but the increasing in the size of the matter or volume of the matter. If the matter size increases, if the matter volume increases we can call that is expansion but how the expansion is happening that is important my dear students so here i am taking a solid children i am taking a solid uh, in the solid you know very well the particles are very tightly packed in between the particles strong attractions are present so when i heat the solid my dear students when i heat the solid so immediately in between the solid particles attraction forces are there these attraction forces are going to break and uh, there is a increase in the value or uh, there is a increase in the size of that solid matter because after heating the solid particles are going away from each other because because in between solid particles these attraction forces are breaking with the help of heating energy which we are giving to the solid. So when you give heat energy to the solid, the solid is expanding because in the solid the particles are going away from each other. So when you heat the solid, the solid will expand my dear students nothing but the size or volume of the solid increases so this is what the expansion of solids so here you are getting it is a solid in a normal mode or cold mode but you when heat this solid it is going to get like this size so here you can see the particles are very close to each other in the first picture but in the second picture you can see in between the solid particles the gap increased by heating and uh, you have to understand here the size of the solid particle size remains same before heating and after heating also so only the distance between solid particles increasing on heating so this is called expansion of solids my dear students and uh, if you observe another slide so that is i am taking here liquid my dear children this is the liquid so the liquid is present like this when you observe and my dear children when you give heat energy to the liquid already in the liquid also particles are present like this liquid particles any matter a solid or liquid or gas that is made up with small particles called atoms or molecules so in the liquid the particles between less attraction forces are present when you compare with the solids so in the liquid the particles are loosely packed when you compare with solids but you are supplying heating energy to the solid what happen immediately in between the liquid particles attraction forces are there this attraction force is also going to break so when between the liquid particles the attraction forces are breaking that liquid particles are moving away from each other like this it means the value 
or the size of the liquid matter also increases when you heat the liquid it means the liquid also expanding the liquid also involving in expansion on heating my dear students so solid is expanding liquid is expanding and gases also expand on heating my dear children so when you heat the solid or liquid or gas the size or the volume of the solid or liquid or gas increases so that is known as expansion of matter i hope you got it thank you children see you all